we haven't had any problems with this at all. It's completely out of the blue. Yes, it's just like uh, we've been here like 23 years. So like this is like totally out of proportion. First an hour, then the second one comes in. They go in, come out with the second uh, person. They put him in the ambulance. They go. They had all this cordoned off. They, uh, you know, it was it was pretty quick after these two came in. They had about eight police cars all around here. They're going in the back everywhere. You know what? The, the second person coming, I think it was a man, but he wasn't large. He was. Uh, he wasn't. I, I couldn't. He was just on IVs coming out on the stretcher. He was covered. You couldn't see him. And, uh, it was uh, quite gruesome. It was like. I think it was her, like, um, people she worked with that were trying to calm her down, but she was uncontrollably crying, and um, they were telling us to stay away, like, the people, not the police, because the police were very cool, collected. They had the, they had the scene already under control. They knew what was going on, and um, they assessed it very quickly. They weren't panicking, so you could tell everything was staying inside that building.